you think, Riley? Hmm? The end of a day. Hmm? The end of another day. Oh my godness. I got some things to talk about. First, <laughs> everything that I've been discussing for the last month, nationwide mental health alert, concerns, they've all of a sudden, all these articles are coming out in the news. 20% of the population, for instance, of adults went to seek mental health uh, assistance. Um, it's being cited in children that it's an issue. All of a sudden, people, other, there's articles coming out saying there's an alert. Yes, there's something to it. Ties in with TV programming. The laundry case, Brian Laundry. Okay, there's a lot of reasons why this case is good and bad. For one thing, I'm glad the guy's dead. Yeah, unfortunately for the family, they want some closure. They want to be able to look in the guy's eyes and watch him squirt a few tears and hear him say how sorry he is for what he did. But that's not going to happen, nor would it benefit anybody, nor would I want to be a guy making a dime off of one single article relative to that subject or to sensationalize the story and then to sell it to the nation repeatedly for the next several months or years it's going to happen. I wouldn't want, there's nothing honorable, there's no integrity, there's no honor in earning an income profiting off of the gossip about that article. What that issue should do is two things, <laughs> mostly. Number one, it should highlight the importance of how stupid our kids are to subject themselves to abuse and not see the red flags and know when they're in too late, especially when you're dependent on this person and you're traveling across the country. The girl should have known when to say enough's enough and sever her ties. Second of all, this kid was supposedly a big outdoor survivalist. Well, it ain't very long into the hunt for the guy, and he's already dead. Yeah, so either his dad killed him like he should have, or the kid was just a blithering idiot. It's just one more example of all these guys in society that think they can survive, and they can't. And it's pretty sad and pathetic, especially all these employers looking for a real person to put on their crew and pull the weight. They're not out there. Everybody's standing around doing as little as they can get by with. It's pretty sad. Meantime, everybody's ignoring all the tough jobs. Nobody wants to do the tough job. Working at the landfill's got to suck. Yeah. Pretty pathetic. And... And the woman who says all of a sudden she finds thousands of files of her being recorded. Yeah, there's an invasion. Suddenly there's articles about invasion of privacy and Big Brother relative to my uh, little discovery that I've made. Yes, things are starting to catch up. So we're playing around with some chords. I've got the D minor chord I've been playing with. The F chord the G7, the C, and the uh, D minor, mostly. And I found some nice, nice voices I like a lot.
happened up there. John's out there, Tim's out there, I was just making a comment earlier about that Aubrey, th or the, uh, the laundry thing, you know, and um, all the stuff I've been saying, and all of a sudden there's articles coming up about invasion of privacy and Big Brother, um, there's articles coming up about um, the nationwide mental health issue, all kinds of them, just like I've been saying, and um, the issue with the laundry guy. For one thing, it highlights all the people in the cities who think they're big and tough and can survive. It ain't very long into the case. This kid's been missing. He's already dead, okay? Some survivor. Yeah. Second of all, I wouldn't want to make one dime off of writing any article about that for the gossip chain across America with all these newsrooms talking about it. The kid's name don't never get to be deserved to be said ever again except for to highlight the helplessness of the state of mankind right now yes that's why all the corporations are out to get the rest of the country folk entertain them win them over with their commercial tactics it's all subliminal programming and mind control yes it's adding up everybody's seeing it you're going to see it in your lifetime there's a big whole basket of conspiracies about to spell out for the public to see as long as the little people keep working at it yeah and they found four people missing because somebody shut the TV off and went outside for a change. Amazing. Four missing people. People get to put some closure on their missing loved ones because somebody got out their dead ass to go hunt down a punk. Yes. It's absolutely sad. Anyway, I'm going to bed. <laughs>